I want to show you a way to leverage some free technology to host a group online and or to interact with other people online in various ways. I think your small group can use this. I think any church can use this. But I want to demonstrate the power of this. So Zoom.us is a free video conference software. There's tons of ways to do this. I tend to rely on Zoom because of convenience, like anything. We like things that are easy, that work well. And Zoom for me over the last year has grown a lot. and. I just, it becomes the default thing that I use and I spend too much time on Zoom now. So Zoom.us is a video conferencing software. It does all sorts of things. But um, what I love about it is how easy it is to host a meeting and share your screen. And that's really what I think the power of this because sharing content with other people is sometimes the hardest thing to do online. It's easy to get a webcam up, but how do you share your screen? And so I think the way a lot of small groups um, can leverage this is through downloading Zoom, you can host um, something. And so I'm gonna show you right now. I already have the software set up. I'm gonna join it. I don't have any lights right now, so I should. But I can on this lower end, I can use this little button called share your screen. And when I share my screen, I can literally just share, I can share a my desktop or an, something on my iPad or whatever. But let's say I wanna share this browser. Now check this out. What I can do now is that I can go to a video and let's say a small group's meeting, you're meeting together as a small group and um, you want to watch a video together. You can sit here, share your screen and now you can watch video content. One of the hardest things I run into is this idea of getting video content to a lot of people. So if six people are in six different areas, do I ship the DVD to six different people? No, with Zoom, you can send it to one person and or you can just access it one time online and everybody can watch it together. So you can watch a YouTube video, you can pause it, you can discuss it. Um, for Saddleback, on my Saddleback, um, one thing that we have is for all of our groups, we have a training material online. So for example, you can go to your group page, you can sit here and you guys can all watch the video study together. And so it's very seamless. It's very seamless to use and there's tons of ways and all you need is um, to download the software. Now the only drawback that I would say is for non-paying customers is uh, you have 45 minutes. And so with 45 minutes, um, all you get is you get 45 minutes to meet. If you want to pay $10 more a month, you can go longer. But I would say use Zoom for 45 minutes. And if you have to start a new call, you have to start a new call. Not a big deal. But Zoom is a powerful way I think your group can leverage and meet with each other via um, via video. There's also um, a way um, on there that if you want to invite people, people can call in. So if I invite people, they give you, um, you can send a URL or um, you have the ability to have a call-in number. And so they give you a toll-free number that people can call in on a phone. So I would check out Zoom for your small group or for your church. It's a powerful way to connect people. Now, there's tons of other ways to use that. I preference this one so because it's I think it's so easy to use. Anyways, let me know what you think and or if you have any other technology that you use in your group.